So first of all, I want to say hello, dear ladies and gentlemen. I'm, my name is Arzu Bayramova. Who are we? What are we doing here? What are we going to do? These are good questions, but I have answers for them. Okay, I'll, I want to show you this, t this uh, the name of the program that is Youth TV. Yes, our program is called Youth TV. Where can, it watch, where can you watch it? You can watch it on our YouTube channel. You can write just Youth TV and you can see, you can watch, you can listen to us. The project is funded by Development and Education Center. The center that helps the people, uh, the young people, to improve their English skills, their Georgian skills, their dancing skills, etc. Today I have two guests. Who are these guests? These guests are uh, Rustam and Staria, a handsome boy and a pretty girl. Yes, who are they? What are they doing here? I will tell, I will tell you, but first of all, I would just like to give you some general, some general information about our project and our program. Our program, as I, as I told you, is Youth TV. It's called Youth TV. I will meet with you once a week. And generally, four times a month. I will have beautiful and handsome guests. I will talk to them about interesting and, and so interesting topics that would be not only for me and for my guests, for you too. It will be very interesting, guys. Trust me. So, I want to start uh, with Daria and then I will continue with Rustam. So guys, Daria, can you give me some general information about yourself? Where are you? What are you doing? Where do you study? Of course. Uh, first of all, thank you for inviting me. Uh, I'm Daria Gasanova uh, from Marniuli. I study, nowadays I study at Ilya State University, yes. International Relations. Mm -hmm. um, I am one of, I'm working at Algetio Center. Uh, I'm a youth worker and one of the uh, participants of TTOL conversation. Yeah, that's good. That sounds so good. Uh, first of all, thank you for inviting me to your program. I am um, Rustam Akhmedov. I am um, graduated from Georgian Technical University. My sphere is public administration. At the moment, I am working at Educational Center Lingua. I am teaching there English and Georgian languages. And I am also studying in other different projects. Thank you. But you don't teach only English language, right? You teach also uh, yes, Georgian I language. I teach both uh, English and Georgian language hmm. there. That sounds good, guys. So, yes, we can continue. Can you see this writing on the hub? I can see, and my guests can see too. What is this? This is T Talk Conversation Club. What is T Talk Conversation Club? T is what we drink. And conversation club is a conversation club, club where the people are sitting at the table, at the tea table like us. They drink tea, but not only they drink tea, they also speak to each other in English language. They choose different topics and they speak, they talk to each other about the topics that they have chosen. Uh, and what topics do you choose, guys? So first, I have a question for Rustam. Rustam, what was your idea? How did you organize your idea? How did you organize your uh, TTOL conversation? Yes, at first our idea was uh, to create... I would just like to take some general information about the okay. idea. Uh, the idea was uh, to create a conversation club. Yes, English conversation club where you can improve your English and also yes. to develop your skills in English. Not only example. speaking skills, not, grammar, vocabulary. Not, yes, no, yes. In general, English speaks, In right? English, yes. Speaking, and uh, then we um, thought a little about it and uh, how it would be different. Yes, our conversation club fr from other conversation yes. clubs, and we then we came up with an idea like a tea talk. It would be an informal environment where youngers, uh, students, yes, uh, could um, participate in uh, this environment and uh, speak in English. Yes. Uh, they uh, improve in these methods. Uh, they could improve their English and um, talk very about different and interesting questions. Yes, which they are interested. Um, at first, at first, our meetings were held in tea house in Mom restaurant. Yes, and 
then now at the moment our meetings are um, held in an online platform. In, in so the one of your friends came up and with an idea yes, that yes. I want to do yes. this, we can do this, yes. and then you can you, can, you start then to, we to do this project. Idea. Yes, then we yes. develop the idea. It yes. was conversation clubs and it As I understood, talk. you want to improve the uh, youngers to improve their English skills, right? Yes, yes. yes you they want to was, uh, also yeah. improve the English. But I'm, yeah. I'm interested in one thing. Why this is called Tito Conversation Club? Uh, Do you drink tea while yes. you speak English? Or? Yeah, okay. uh, we wanted to involve uh, young people. Informal yeah, environment, informal right? Environment. It wouldn't be like simple conversation yes. club. Yeah. So we uh, created this idea, tea talk conversation. Uh, as you know, we as a Regionist drink tea all yes. the time. Yeah. 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 That's why So it, it wouldn't be like lecture. So they would drink tea while speaking, while talking in English. Yes. So it wouldn't be boring for them. You know, yeah, yeah, it would be more informal than more informal, yeah, it would yes. be formal, right? Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds so good. So I have a question okay. for Daria now. Okay. Yes, when you do, yeah, yeah. Yes. It's, of course, no, we drink tea, so we have the informal environment for all. Okay, I have a question for Daria. Daria, when you started this project, mm -hmm. uh, I think you started this project in 2019, right? Yes. Yes. So it was it your start up or it was just um, no, we, I can't call it like startup, yeah. but it was uh, one of the best ideas of our group that we could create this uh, tea talk and involve young people who knows the English in, in, in basic level yeah. and wants to improve. Also, uh, uh, as Rustam mentioned, we uh, hold uh, some uh, presentations about our uh, backgrounds, about our fields. For example, one of our uh, participants studies in medicine. Yeah. And he talks about medicine. Uh, yes. For example, I am a youth worker and I know about some uh, most projects uh, to study abroad or exchange programs. And I talk about them and give information so young people yes. can uh, use this chance and go to abroad, mm -hmm. for example. So as your project director told me, um, you will have other plans too, yeah? Yeah, we have uh, lots of uh, f plans for two, 2021. You have some plans and you will make some plans again and... Yes, of course. For 2020 years, yes. 21 uh, years. Yes, one of, them, uh, one of the idea is, like, as I mentioned, we hold uh, different, um, different presentations. So we will have, again, presentations for um, once in a week. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and every participant will uh, show their presentation and in the end of the month uh, we will choose two uh, winner of like winner who presented the best the most successful yes person, right? and the most active participant so we will give them some uh, yes. presents they will be awarded to, yes. just yeah. symbolic some yes. symbolic yes. to motivate them to uh, partic participate yeah so I have a question one question again about the coronavirus yes so we know that the coronavirus uh, has took so has taken all over the world yes. and also our country Georgia so how did you organize your projects after coronavirus pandemic. Uh, yes, what did you do? Yes, you are right. Coronavirus also influenced our because the gathering uh, for the public yes, badly is influenced our also project. And uh, then we started to hold our meeting online. And yeah. uh, but uh, uh, at first we had uh, some technical problems uh, in yeah. yes. And but then we used uh, to uh, talking. Uh, and also can um, how to say we um, handle these problems yeah. then uh, continue our meetings as it was usual uh, we um, had uh, different uh, presentations for example in each meeting each participants uh, um, it's, uh, they must not make presentations they uh, if they want Yes, and uh, they're interested yes yeah. yes because it's informal and they must not say so it depends yeah, on them yes. right uh, they make presentations and uh, uh, not presentations, also um, we had uh, discussions, yeah. uh, presentations. Uh, also we had some guests from abroad online, virtual, yes. so they could join us and talk about their experiences, mm -hmm. talk about themselves to help us in our uh, experiences to improve mm -hmm. our English and other things. Mm, that's good. So as I understood, you don't, ha you don't only speak English yes. language. 
you also do presentations, yes. you also have uh, as a guest public figures, yes. etc. You choose yes. various topics, yes. various yes. materials, also then you present mm -hmm. them. Yeah, also we help each other to improve our English. Yeah. And That's yes. good. And yeah. also studying English, yes also studying because we sometimes have some lessons in and presentations teach and yes, also we study teach, we example, also talk about talk about, talk yeah. about uh, opportunities as yes. I mentioned. Uh -huh. but you don't only speak, speak english only learn english yes. also we you learn, learn speak, a lot yes, of information, information about english because, uh, all the participants uh, share their knowledge and uh, you know their experiences mm -hmm. yes and yeah. it's very interesting to listen to them and to get new information from mm -hmm. them mm -hmm. yes so your participants mm. don't only speak English and don't only learn improve, uh, learn and improve their yes. English skills. Yes. They yeah. also learn a lot of information. Yes. Yeah, they learn about a lot of information. Some also, topics. they develop their skills. For example, public uh, skill. For example, public talking. For example, yes, yeah. they make presentations. Uh, when there, we also invite some guests, and they also listen their presentations. We have also they discussions. discussions. That they is very good give for their advice language. for us, which yeah. is very important for us. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah, I have one more question, guys. So, uh, for example, I want to participate in your program, for example, right? And I am 15 or I'm 16 years old. Uh -huh. I don't know English basically. Uh -huh. I know just letters and some words, for example, 100 words, just like mother, father, etc. Uh -huh. So, can I participate in your program, in your project? Unfortunately. Can I improve my English uh, skills? Unfortunately, no. But. It Unfortunately, it would be difficult for you to understand yeah. Yeah. if you know only writing, yes, if you know only basic. So I have to improve my English more, more, more and more and then I can participate. Improve, yes, a basic level, for example, uh, yeah. pre-intermediate, you know in English we have some levels pre-intermediate, yeah, your level should be, I say, I would say pre-intermediate, um, pre-intermediate pre to join. Easy. So as you, as you see, it's conversation club, so yeah. you, you yeah. must be able to talk even a little bit. Uh, yes, but um, but I think, in my opinion, yes, because we people we have different opinions. Yes, all of us different opinions. I think uh, basic, but also pre-intermediate because yeah, pre-intermediate is a level where you he or she should, he or she ready, yes, ready should for it. give his or her opinion about the topic. Yes, yeah. because he knows some grammar, but basic he only say, for example, um, elementary to talking uh, simple things. Yes, for example, but if you are level so they have to communicate yes, you have to communicate. Yes, yeah. for example, yes, basically, That's but clear. very important uh, topics there. Yeah, that you sometimes hard. Some, some sometimes yeah. hard topics. Yes. But you help them, of course, yeah, yes, sure. to understand it. Yes. To, yeah. sure. And I think you share your... Uh, so, um, for example, I know a topic that you don't know, so I can share with you in English language that yes. exactly. you do it too. Exactly. exactly yes. mm -hmm. So that's why you called, uh, it's called Conversation Club. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So you communicate with each other only and only English language. Only, only English, you don't yes. use no, any no, other language, Georgian, Azerbaijani. Language, no, no. Georgian, yes. Yeah. We use yeah. only English. And uh, and can Georgian people can participate in your program? Can Azerbaijani people? Of course, of course. Of course. Every, of course. Every yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's clear. Uh, so, what plans do you have for the 2021 years? Uh, Daria said, Daria told us. And do you have any other plans, other ideas that you want to do? That you want to? Uh, we we plan to Im involve uh, more people to our conversation club yeah. to help them improve their English, but also improve their experiences and use lots of opportunities which they don't know what's going on but in Georgia. But how do young people can communicate with you, can contact with you uh, about a Facebook project? Page. Yes, yes, we have yeah, Facebook, Facebook page. page. From there, they can contact with us. Yeah. So the Facebook page is called uh, Tito, Tito, yeah, Tito yeah, Conversation Tito Club Marniuli or something? Uh, no. Only Tito. Tito. Tito, mm -hmm. yeah. 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 That's and there is contact information yes, of us. Contact. Yeah. So I have one more and the last question, the final question for Rustam. Rustam, which organization help you technically? Yes, technically um, organization, Azerbaijan Embassy in Georgia, yeah. that organization help us technically support our project. And it has started the, this year, yes. right? Yes. From this year, yes. 2021 years. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. So guys, that was our program, that was our first program. I want to thank um, my guests, Daria and Rustam. Mm -hmm. I will meet you 
um, next week we will be together again and I will have guests but different guests so thank you thank you thank you and at last finally I want to say you I want to tell you that join us and make your dreams come true thank you guys for watching us and for listening to us <laughs>